Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I am going to be sharing my weekly grocery haul for the week for weight loss on my weight loss journey. I've lost 57 pounds now and I am sharing and documenting all of that and I'm on my way to my next 50 pounds. So these are all the foods that really help me on my weight loss journey. These are things that I eat since the beginning pretty much and I wanted to share that with you hopefully that it's helpful in some way and if it is please let me know in the comments down below give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more so you don't miss out I share lots of grocery hauls recipe videos what I eat in a week meal prep videos vlogs and things like that so I would love to have you here and let's just jump right into this week's grocery haul which is from Aldi. I do track all of my food in the iTrack Bites app. It's just a weight loss app that helps you um, just track your food and your calorie intake and they give you a daily set of bites um, and you want to try to hit that daily goal. It's very similar to WW Weight Watchers. It's pretty much a copycat of that and I really like it and I also am able to track my calories through this app. You're kind of able to do both which is awesome. So I'm going to scan a lot of these items so that if if you also are on iTrack Bites, Better Balance Plan or WW Blue, these are pretty much going to be the same as WW Blue. Um, then you guys will know the bites for it. And then, of course, I'll share the calories because I now, too, very much look at calories as well. Um, I got some reduced fat crackers. These are called Thin Wheat. So they're very similar to Wheat Thins. And you can have one serving for four bites and 120 calories. And a serving is 16 crackers which is great so 16 for four we had some peppered <laughs> jerky in the car my husband and I split this so we got that and then I got some brown rice instant brown rice actually it says it cooks in 10 minutes and we got this because we're gonna be making lots of bowls so we like to do like taco bowls or just chicken and asparagus with like lemon dill sauce or something um, but we like to have our base carbs be either brown rice or potatoes so we got some easy brown rice for that and then I got this last time I was at Aldi and I really liked them these are turkey sausage spinet omelet bites very similar to like the Starbucks breakfast bites I thought that they were going to be super small because they're six bites and 180 calories for the two. Um, I thought they were going to be small. I was like, gosh, six bites is kind of a lot, but they're bigger than the Starbucks bites, which are five bites usually at Starbucks. Um, these are way bigger. So they're really great in size and they were so, so good. I loved them. So I picked these up again and they come with four total. So two breakfast um, days, I can have this when I don't feel like making breakfast, but I want something good. Um, love those, so happy I got that the first time because now I just get it every time. <laughs> I got some turkey bacon and I'm gonna try that TikTok bacon twist. I don't know if you guys have seen that. Maybe I'll insert a picture on the screen, but you basically twist your bacon and you bake it on parchment paper and they get like this really crispy bacon twist and it looks delicious. So I'm hoping it works with turkey bacon. I'm gonna try it out, I'll let you guys know. I got some coffee, my mother-in-law said that this German roast coffee was amazing. So I picked that up. We also got some chicken breast tenderloins. I love to cook chicken breast tenderloins for our source of protein. I love the tenders because I like, I don't know, I don't like having to cut all those huge chicken breasts, so this comes in handy. I'm going to be changing backgrounds on you guys because I have such a small counter space in the RV that I have to like maneuver the camera all the time. There we go. Okay, veggie bag. There's a lot of veggies in here. We got some mushrooms and I love to make warm avocado toast. So basically that's just like a Sara Lee slice of bread, which is one bite and 40 calories and then avocado smash on top. And then I like to saute mushrooms and cherry tomatoes and then put it on top. And it is so good. I did that at the beach not so long ago. I made that for breakfast like every day. And now I'm hooked on it. So I got mushrooms and tomatoes for that. I got a little tiny papaya. Papaya is my favorite fruit. It's so good. So hydrating. Good for the skin. I love it. So yummy. And I usually do lime juice and like lime zest on top. You can even add some yogurt in it and it's really good. I got two things of these little tiny potatoes. Got two of these. We like to air fry these, bake, bake them in the oven if you want, if you don't have an air fryer. 
um, just like to have little tiny potatoes and you can have that for a really great amount of points. You don't have to eliminate carbs if you don't want to. This just got stuck on my finger. <laughs> Onions. We got so many apples because me and Joey both have been loving apples in the fridge and get them nice and cold. So we got some wild twist apples, honey crisp apples, and we're going to be snacking on those quite a bit. And then we got this, and this is for my husband mostly because he really enjoys gyros. And yeah, for him, this is great because it's all together. Like everything comes in this, and you can have one sandwich for 510 calories. Um, but yeah, this is going to be good for him for like work because he goes so long without eating um, during his shift. So yeah, we got this little kit for my husband. I'll probably have a bite of it though because I do look gyros myself. <laughs> and then we got some peppers and corn. I like to have corn on occasion. I got some 96.4 lean ground beef for burgers and bulgogi bowls. I like to like make ground Asian bulgogi beef with like lettuce cups or rice. Super good. And then we have my favorite. I love these half sour pickles. They're so good. This is a great option for snacks um, because I think it's like five calories for one. Yeah, it's five calories for one. Really just a cucumber. So um, I love to have that. And then we got some celery for dips as well. A little bit of crackers, a little bit of celery kind of keeps you full um, when you add veggies to it. And then we got my favorite hummus is caramelized onion hummus um, from Sabri. So this one's caramelized onion from Aldi and it's 60 calories for two tablespoons two bites so you can have two bites two tablespoons for two bites and 60 calories and also that's really good on your sandwiches or wraps I got some parmesan cheese because I like to grade parmesan a little bit into my salad or my eggs it's really yummy we got this new dressing this looks so good it's like an avocado ranch yeah, it is. Two tablespoons for two bites. This is two tablespoons for 35 calories. It's the Little Salad Bar Avocado Ranch dressing. This is going to be great for salads and also taco bowls. I like to do ranch and avocado together and then hot sauce. So I feel like this would be perfect for that. And then I got this little snack just because I'm obsessed with these little snacks. And when I really want it, I'll have it. This is 260 calories for the whole thing. But it's like a little prosciutto and cheese with crackers. It's eight bites, which is a lot for this tiny little thing. But this is mainly for like on the go when like we're rushing out the door and I'm really hungry and like we're traveling somewhere or like running errands, I will take something like this with me. But yeah, it's worth it to me because I really enjoy it and it's fast and easy and I don't have to like get something while I'm out and about. So I do like to get those on occasion, but I only, ooh, I do only usually get one at a time because if I have too many in the house, I will like eat them every day. <laughs> um, I got some eggs. Eggs are zero bites actually. That doesn't mean when I say zero bites, like chicken is zero, beans are zero, fruits and veg are zero, eggs are zero on Better Balance Plan. I want a preference that doesn't mean zero calories. So you want to keep in mind, even though it's zero bites throughout your daily bite point allowance, I get 30. Um, you still want to keep in mind that it's not zero calories, so you don't want to overeat on those things too much. But basically the idea behind making foods zero bites is that you eat more of those fruits and veggies and lean um, foods that you'll get fuller faster and you'll rely more on those really good foods rather than other things that are like pretty high in bites um, and high in calories. So I just wanted to preference that. Um, so that you know. I got some Parmesan crisp for salads and soup and cashews. You guys, if you're familiar um, with my nacho cashew cheese sauce, it's a plant-based sauce. I have it on my website. I'll leave a link down below. It is the best sauce ever. Um, it's just so good. And it's literally made of plants, cashews, and seasonings. It's amazing. And I make it every week pretty much. <laughs> I got some avocados and some baby spinach. I like to have spinach for like egg omelets and salads and wraps. I just love spinach and smoothies. So got that, got some paper plates so I don't have to do dishes every day, twice a day. You feel me? <laughs> I got some chicken breast, canned chicken breast. I used to like 
eat this all the time in the very beginning of my journey and I haven't had it in so long but I've been seeing awesome TikTok recipes uh, made with chicken breast, canned chicken breast. So I'm going to try those recipes out and maybe I'll film a what I eat in a day showing you guys these TikTok recipes I'm talking about. One of them is a freaking chicken breast pizza crust. We'll see how that turns out. I want to try it. I got some chickpeas because I'm roasting these. I love to have roast chickpeas and salads. So I got that. I got some boring house stuff. <laughs> we got some peanut butter for the apples. That's mainly for my husband. If I do have peanut butter, it's usually PB2 powder mixed with sugar-free syrup. That's like a little hack that I created and I created that in the very beginning of my journey and I am so happy you guys love it. Um, Cause yeah, a lot of people found out about it and it's so good and yeah, you get that peanut butter fix. I got some sauce. I will add a little bit of this sauce into like chicken breast to make it nice and yummy and saucy. And then we'll have it over rice or over zucchini noodles is another way that I like to do it. So we picked that up because I do really enjoy those kind of sauces. We got some black beans for taco bowls and black bean burgers and things like that. I like to make my own black bean burgers. I have a recipe on my website for that as well. And then we got some tuna because I love to have tuna in the house. Then we have some more stuff in this bag. This is the last bag. We got blueberries and cilantro. And then, I love this, peeled garlic. The best, the best. I don't like to peel garlic. <laughs> I got the black bean salad you guys mentioned in my last Aldi haul. I got the chickpea salad. It was like chickpea, cranberry, edamame. And you guys said that the black bean salad was really good. So I picked that up to add to my salads. I'm really excited. You can have half a cup for 100 calories, which is great. I'll probably do a half a cup and toss it in my salad or a taco bowl since it's like black beans and corn. That'd be really good. I got some unsweetened almond milk for coffee and cooking. And then I got a big thing of cold brew coffee. Califia Farms. And then I got some asparagus. That's my current favorite veggie is like asparagus. It's so good. And then we got module dates. I like to make like granola raw gran granola bars or balls and I add dates to like help form it and sweeten it. It's so good. Um, I have a recipe of that on as well on my website. I have some green beans. So we got lots of greens, lots of veggies. That's the goal for this week is we're eating pretty healthy and clean. Me and my husband. <laughs> and some carrots. Um, I like to eat carrots. Honestly, I love carrots. Another great snack. And that is not everything. Last, I always admire when I see people get flowers and share them in their videos. So I wanted to share the beautiful flowers. I got these for $3.99 each. So I got a white one and a pink one. And I thought that would be really cute and very spring and happy. So that is everything that we got from Aldi. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I am going to be posting some what I eat in a days and I'm filming a husband and wife what I eat in a day for weight loss because my husband also is trying to lose weight and I feel like he's really been inspired and it's going to buckle down with me. <laughs> um, and I felt like that would be interesting to show what also my husband eats on a weight loss journey compared to what I'm eating and things like that. So yeah, I will have some really good recipes in all my upcoming videos as well, so stay tuned for that. I hope you guys are all doing well. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it, and I appreciate you guys, so thank you for all your support on this channel. We officially hit 35K. I hit 35K the other day, and yeah, that was just huge for me. That was a big goal I had, so just thank you for watching my videos and the comments and the likes. It all helps, and it all matters, so thank you. <laughs> but. That's it. I hope you guys have a good one and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.